a lot of power in this. But um, but the notion of the face, if I'm hearing this right, it it's almost it it, it um, for me it it was the idea that um, you you can uh, project all kinds of negatives on to other people, but when you meet them, mm-hmm. there's a face to face. If they're talking literally face to face, then mm-hmm. that will change a lot of things that are going on in terms of relationship. Uh, when you talk about that face, there is a that there is something that moves in us that generates that affiliative bond. When we humanize the other, that is certainly. Right. I think there is, you know, and in in, in lots of so ways, the, there is something that that when we begin to to see the folks that we group together as an individual and have that indivi- in, individual connection, then something shifts and changes. So that there is there is this notion of the face, and so uh, we we talk and hear a lot about this notion of mentalization and yes. uh, that the the act of mentalization is turning to the face of the other and seeing their depth and complexity finding a heartbeat in them right. and in moments of of high emotionality when our amygdala is going off like a car alarm and we find ourselves falling back into that fight flight or freeze we don't think of subtleties of the other we are mm-hmm. either you know we, we are actively attempting to be able to preserve ourselves or to preserve whatever parts um now that we can fight for ideas trying to preserve those too that that's the idea of the um, of the face, and the second one is this notion of the light, and this is interesting. What I think she really this is sort of abbreviating the light of knowledge. Oh, okay. Because um, there is something about our capacity to to understand, to learn, and to continue to grow in some ways. It's very important, and so that is a thing. So it's not only to have it, we have this this visceral and almost primitive account of, uh, uh, encounter with the other that generates this sense of connection. We have the capacity to begin to understand them okay. and to understand ourselves. And that makes a big difference. And That's 